we are in the crowd of Changjian and I'm so impressed with this city. It's amazing. Like it's 40 years. It's like so new and so different from Brazil. I can bring back uh, a lot of memories because I studied electronic in the bachelors. A country that went through the uh, manufacturing process and now they are in the knowledge world. In China you are producing knowledge. You can see right now, it's living. That's my drink that I just got from the drone. Also, I'm happy to know that Huawei is supporting all the operation here with the drones, right? And uh, hopefully, I, I would like to see that kind of model in Brazil. Also, supporting by Huawei is a big way. Say hello. Hey, we have tried uh, an SUV high luxury car, an Aito car. An M9. Your colleagues took us from a parking space and the car was by itself <laughs> getting out of the parking. And the, for me, the most relevant thing, first of all, is you feel very secure. It has been a very smooth drive. You have a lot of functionalities, <laughs> okay? Taking advantage of the technology to be very comfortable within the car. You in China are very advanced in using the technology for autonomous driving. The level of sophistication that you were able to achieve already and that you continue doing is very remarkable. Okay? And the application to Latin American markets is to the whole world. Tu principal centro es el cliente, que es un poco lo que nos han explicado y nos han tratado de entender y así nos han tratado, creo que hacen la diferencia. Technology, and specifically these new developments with AI, are serving some sort of bridge to connect people in a much easier way. For example, I don't speak Chinese, but I've been using AI tools here when I came here in order to be able to communicate this new technology that we saw today with the avatars and answering you questions uh, about like where you are located and what you are seeing in your own language. here also to look for Pangu models and learn more about AI. Today we have bring a lot of innovative product and solution to you. We have launched the first Portuguese, Spanish language foundation models to our customers. We try to accelerate every company's your uh, process for the intelligent upgrade. With Huawei we have a series of services already migrated. Você vê que o principal aspecto que tem o Huawei tem que ver com o apoio e a cercania que tem o equipo técnico do Huawei, que hace muita falta em essa transição. É, estamos finalizando essa primeira etapa e, ó, e, e o principal objetivo na viagem agora é a, a hora tem que ver com como podemos fazer melhor uso, por exemplo, de DeepSeek, de IA, de como lo pode integrar dentro de, de nossas plataformas. The story of Oka and Huawei starts like five years ago. At the beginning, all our technical architectures, they were not so familiar with cloud services. The help of all the Huawei experts, not only to provide technical support, but also helping us with financial support in order to have proof of concept and to try new services. I think it was played a key role in our evolution and our transformation. We have been working in a partnership, a digital transformation project with a large use of AI that is permitting us to improve our revenue. I'm really impressed by everything I have had the opportunity to see here. Just reinforce the idea how a cloud 
is the best cloud platform in the world. I also surprised it with the amount of people dedicated to research and development. This gives us the idea of how powerful how it is in terms of technology. We are going to do business, of course, very soon. We are sure that how we can bring recovery to another level. I landed in the temple. I have in time. See you next year. <laughs> <laughs>